President Trump encourages Americans who have recovered from COVID-19 to donate their plasma. One America's Jen Pellegrino has more. In the race to extinguish the burning embers of COVID-19, the president has highlighted the use of various treatments, hydroxychloroquine, remdesivir, and increasingly promising the body's own plasma. For those who have recovered from the novel coronavirus, convalescent plasma has emerged as a promising experimental treatment for those battling severe cases. The Mayo Clinic states that convalescent plasma may help boost ability to fight the virus in those who have contracted it, and it may help those who are moderately ill from experiencing more severe complications. President Trump, speaking at a roundtable at the American Red Cross National Headquarters, urged recovered Americans to get out and donate. My administration is partnering with commercial labs, insurers, and healthcare providers to encourage those who have had the virus to donate plasma. So if you've had the virus, if you donate, it would be a terrific thing. Uh, we really need donations of the plasma. American Red Cross CEO Gail McGovern said demand for convalescent plasma is now exceeding the organization's supply. Consider donating plasma. Uh, if you've had COVID because you are going to do a wonderful thing. It's easy. It doesn't take a lot of time. And I can tell you that when you donate blood, and you leave our blood center, you feel so great. You just feel so great about yourself because you just saved someone's life. HHS Secretary Alex Azar says convalescent plasma therapy is going to be a major national initiative in the months ahead. We now have more than 48,000 patients that have received convalescent plasma. We've invested more than $1.7 billion through our Operation Warp Speed, which is the president's initiative to get vaccines, therapeutics, and diagnostics to the American people in record time. Um, and when it comes to therapeutics, Warp Speed means weeks, not months. Over 2.2 million Americans have now recovered from COVID-19. Jen Pellegrino, One America News, the White House. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.